In the heart of a bustling city, tucked away behind a row of old, whispering trees, lay a secret garden known to very few. This wasn't just any garden, but an enchanted one, where the flowers whispered secrets and the trees sang lullabies. The caretaker of this magical place was a kind-hearted elderly lady named Mrs. Wren. Mrs. Wren had known about the garden's magic since she was a little girl. Her grandmother had shown it to her, explaining that the garden was a haven for all creatures, big and small, and that its magic needed to be nurtured and protected. Over the years, Mrs. Wren had cared for the garden with love and patience, and in return, the garden flourished under her care, its magic growing stronger with each passing day. One sunny morning, as Mrs. Wren was tending to the roses that hummed softly in the breeze, she noticed a young boy peering through the garden gate. His name was Leo, and he lived in the apartment building next to the garden. Leo had always been curious about the garden, having heard whispers of its enchantment from his bedroom window. Sensing his kind heart, Mrs. Wren invited Leo into the garden, promising to show him its wonders. As they walked along the stone path, Leo watched in amazement as the flowers turned towards him, greeting him with gentle nods. The trees rustled their leaves in welcome, and a group of butterflies danced around him in a whirl of colors. Mrs. Wren explained to Leo that the garden was alive with magic, a place where plants and animals lived in harmony, and where every flower and blade of grass had its own story. She showed him how to listen to the whispers of the flowers and how to understand the songs of the trees. Leo listened with wide eyes, his heart filling with wonder. As the days turned into weeks, Leo visited the garden every chance he got. He learned to speak the language of the garden, to care for its inhabitants, and to protect its secrets. The garden, in turn, opened up to him, revealing its hidden nooks and crannies, each with its own magical surprise. One evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon, painting the sky in shades of orange and pink, Mrs. Wren shared the garden's biggest secret with Leo. At the very heart of the garden, hidden among the thickest vines, was a magical fountain. Its waters were said to bring happiness and inspiration to anyone who drank from it. Together, Mrs. Wren and Leo approached the fountain, its waters sparkling under the moonlight. They each took a sip, and at that moment, they felt a surge of joy and creativity flow through them. The garden around them seemed to glow brighter, its magic pulsing like the beat of a heart. From that day on, Leo became the garden's protector alongside Mrs. Wren. They worked hand in hand, caring for the enchanted garden, ensuring its magic remained safe and strong. And as Leo grew, so did his love for the garden and all its creatures. The enchanted garden became a legend in the city a reminder of the magic that exists in the world, hidden in plain sight, waiting to be discovered by those with kind hearts and open minds. And Mrs. Wren and Leo, the guardians of the garden, lived happily, surrounded by the magic they cherished and protected.